right, today we are going to be doing this backpack. We've got a, we're going to be putting this logo on the inside of this pocket. In order to do that, we're going to need to use our pocket hoop. We've got this really neat pocket thing that I bought from um, Durkee, and it comes with a bunch of different hoops. This one I had special made at a local machine shop, and it's going to be perfect for this pocket. So we're going to start with the sticky back and put this on the back of the hoop. Just like that. It's super easy. No big deal. We got a blank backpack here. We're going to unzip this pocket. And slide that right in there. Okay, in order to center this, you're just going to make sure you've got a, the equal amounts on each side of the pocket here. And an equal amount from the top. That sticky back really helps with hard to hoop areas like this. I get, um, I buy that in bulk from the embroidery store. So you can go online and get that big gigantic rolls of that for a lot cheaper than you can get at your local embroidery shop. Just like that. Now, you've got your dirt hoop here. This goes on each side of the top of the pocket, like this. So these go in here like this. And then you tighten them down. And then from there, you can slide this into the embroidery machine, just like you would a regular hoop. So, now we just have to make sure that the sides of this backpack fit underneath so that it doesn't get caught on anything. So, we're going to want that to be like this. So, go to Staples, get yourself some heavy-duty clippies, flip this puppy over. And pinch this like this. And another one at the bottom. This is much easier to do it here than after you get this on the machine. But when you look at this, it's going to hang really nicely under the machine. Nothing's going to get caught. So we're going to move you over to the embroidery machine and we're going to show you how this works. Okay, today we are going to be using another PR600. This one has a um, stand so you can drop things like purses and backpacks and a lot of other stuff underneath this centerpiece. So we're going to take our backpack and slide that in there like that. And if you notice, this bag hangs down in the middle, and because we wedged this on the bottom, it's not going to touch either side while we're stitching. We've already got it centered. We've got the logo up on the screen, and everything's locked in really nicely. We're going to go ahead and just get this started, and then I will zoom in so you guys can see exactly how well it stitches.
Okay, people, 67 minutes later, it's finally done. I'm going to take the clippies off the back side. And the pins out of the front. This tear away so it just comes right out. We're gonna have to cut a few spots here and there but other than that our bag is done and ready to go. So if you want to get you a purse or a pocket hoop go to embroiderystore.com and get you a dirty purse hoop. Now, if you want more uh, videos like this one, please like, subscribe, and share this. And we'll have another video again next week. Thank you.